Let's get right into the news. Ladies and gentlemen, there, there is an explosive new article about the White House in Vanity Fair magazine where it says, according to staffers, Donald Trump is acting moodier and more erratic every day and recently confided in one White House aide telling him, quote, I hate everyone in the White House. <laughs> there are a few exceptions, but I hate them. <laughs> is this guy the President of the United States or a cast member on Big Brother? <laughs> everyone in the house except for Jasmine and Denise. <laughs> They've always got my back. Uh, in the article, aides who are close to Donald Trump describe him as unstable, losing a step and unravelling. Meanwhile, those of us not close to Donald Trump are like, yep, I'd use those words too. <laughs> um, Trump is basically, he's like an old Christmas sweater. <laughs> he's unravelling and you have to pretend you like him in front of your grandmother. <laughs> Trump said, he said that he hates everyone in the White House with a few exceptions. I think we have a photo of one of the exceptions. <laughs> and Trump's advisers may have a point about him losing a step. There was an odd moment today when Trump held a ceremony to sign an executive order, but he forgot the one important part of the signing ceremony, which is the part where you sign, right? <laughs> and he wandered off early and Mike Pence had to pull him back. Take a look. <laughs> Donald Trump seems to be the only person on the planet who is able to forget that Donald Trump is the president. <laughs> I guess watching this, the good news is there is no way that man remembers the nuclear codes. <laughs> Uh, and Trump wasn't happy about having to walk all the way back to sign this executive order. In fact, this is how he signed it. <laughs> I hate everyone in the White House. 